Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Sam and I would love to have you guys subscribe so you won't miss out on any new videos. So today, I'm super excited to be doing a little hygiene body care haul because that is just what I've been so obsessed with lately. I don't know, I have my little moments where I'm into different things, but I'm super into like body care and hygiene products right now. So I picked up a bunch of new products because I've been so inspired by people. So yeah, let's just get started. I got some of these products at Ulta and Target. Actually, no, I think I got all of them at Target. And I also have a mini Ulta haul for you guys at the end just because I wanted to throw these in there. But yeah, let's just get started. So the first thing I bought were these June and Moon Watermelon Sugar Scrubs and they basically come in these little cubes. They smell so amazing. It seriously just smells like candy to me and basically you're supposed to like use one of these cubes when you shower and you run it under hot water and rub it all over your body. It's supposed to be like an exfoliator and like a, a body like cleanser. Honestly, I just thought they were cute so I picked them up. Do I think I would repurchase them again? Probably not. I don't think that they are as ideal for a exfoliator. I like my other ones that I have, but they're still fun to try out and I'm glad I bought them because now I know what they're like because I've been always eyeing them. They smell so good too, but basically there's like a bunch of cubes. I don't even know how many like maybe like 15 of them in here and you can either use one full one or half of one it doesn't matter it's up to you but yeah this is the first one I have and another thing I picked up was this Johnson's Shea and Cocoa Butter Oil Gel basically I really like to use like oils and like in the shower body conditioners a lot so I picked this one up it's like kind of like Vaseline in a way but I thought it was really good Basically, you just put this on when your body is damp after you shower and it seriously makes your body feel so, so smooth. I'm obsessed with this. I think everyone needs to go out and get this, especially if you guys are lazy to put on like moisturizer and lotion after you shower. This is really, really good and keeps me super moisturized and it'll be really great for sensitive skin as well because it's made by Johnson. So, yeah. Another thing that I picked up was a tree hut uh, sugar scrub. I love these. These are probably my favorite um, scrubs ever. They are pretty abrasive I would say but I love that. Like I want like all my dead skin to come off my body. So I got this one which I have never tried. It's the cotton candy one. I see this one all over like people's like shower TikToks and I'm obsessed with those right now. I really want to start making them but I'm awkward and this one is just so pretty. Like it's like so pink and shimmery i think it's super super cute you can find these at like target or ulta or walmart i got mine at target but i know they have a bunch of scents at like ulta so yeah this is another one they range from about like six dollars so pretty inexpensive in my opinion and they last me a really really long time so i love that another thing that i got was a dove uh two pack of this bar soap i used to hate bar soap so so much but i heard that bar soap is actually what cleans your body the best so i picked up this two pack to try it out and see if i feel any different from using this and then pretty much what i will do is use like my bath and body works or other shower gels that i have afterwards for like a second cleanse but this is what i'll be using to get like a deep clean so yeah love that and then um, I got this Maui Moisture Hair Care. Again, I see so many people on TikTok using this. And it's just a conditioner. This is the Hibiscus and Water Lightweight Hydration. And let's just see what this smells like. It smells so good. Oh, wow. I only got the conditioner because I have so much shampoo left. My parents gave me like a big like big pump of like this Pantene shampoo that I have so I just really needed conditioner and I thought this bottle was so cute they have so many other kinds too so I'm really excited about this I will let you guys know how all these work out as well so yeah and then I picked up this isn't really like 
body care. I guess it's more hygiene. But I found this Purell Soothing Gel Triple Action Hand Sanitizer. It's so hard to find Purell these days, but I actually found it. And this one has aloe in it too. So it just looks like that. You guys probably all know what this looks like. And then the next thing I bought was um, this... I don't even know. Oh, OGX, yeah. OGX Hydration and Sea Kelp and Hyaluronic Acid Scrub and Wash. Again, I see this all over TikTok. So I really wanted to buy it. I only see the coffee one or the strawberry one on there, but they were out of those ones, sadly. So, yeah. This one also smells really good. I kind of want to see what it looks like. Oh, it's just white. I thought the scrub and the... I thought the liquid was going to be like green because the bottle's green, but if you guys can see like it's just white and it has little beads in it. So yeah, this should be interesting. I love OGX. I use a lot of their products, so I'm excited to use this and plus hyaluronic acid is super good for your skin, especially during like this winter time. So really, really excited about this and I can't wait to try it out for you guys. And finally, I'm just going to move on to the Ulta products that I got. If you guys don't want to see this, I'm sorry, but I just really wanted to throw it in here so it would make this haul a little bit longer. But I first got this NYX Suede Matte Lipstick. I see this color by Coconut Kathy. She always recommends this. It's in the shade Dainty Days. It's just like the prettiest nude color ever, and I have it on right now. And I think it looks pretty good. So this is the first item that I bought. And then I also got a NYX Epic Ink Liner. This liner is so good. If you guys are looking for a good like ink liner, try this one. I got it in brown. I have a black one, but I also like to have brown as well. So yeah. And then I also got this ColourPop blush. I just was obsessed with the packaging and I've been so into blush lately. This is what it looks like. It's in the shade Juice Bar. I don't know. But this is what the color looks like. I think it looks really, really cute. Just like a pinky color. I can swatch it for you guys. Ooh, yeah, it's very pigmented too. So, obsessed with that. And then I got this e.l.f. Putty Primer. I've been seeing so many people like rave about this so I really wanted to try it for myself because I definitely need to start wearing more eye primer I always get lazy but I cannot get this out all right so I got this elf um putty eye primer and it's in the color rose let me just open it for you guys it looks pretty interesting it just looks like a uh, mac paint pot it feels that's weird. Feels very dry. Maybe you just need to like melt it with your hands a little bit, but yeah. We'll see how I like this. I don't know. And finally, the most exciting thing that I'm really excited to show you guys, I got the Madison Beer X Morphe eyeshadow palette. I love Madison Beer. I think she's beautiful. So I really wanted her eyeshadow palette and they had one left so I was like you know what it's meant to be I meant to have this eyeshadow palette so let me just take off the little plastic and show you guys look at those colors that is so gorgeous you could literally do anything with this eyeshadow palette like you could make it daytime appropriate or nighttime and yeah, the packaging in the front, I feel like there could have been a little more done to it, but still cute nonetheless. I still like it and stuff. So this is the last item that I got. Alrighty, you guys. So that is the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the hygiene products that I bought and like seeing all of the makeup that I bought. I still love doing like beauty and fashion and stuff. So I'm excited to continue doing those kinds of videos. But thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what kind of videos you guys would like to see and what kind of content you guys want from me. But yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!